Do you wake up at night with unquenchable thirst, peeing constantly, or with tingling in your hands and feet? If so, you could be ignoring warning signs of a serious illness, type 2 diabetes. Type 2 diabetes is a chronic condition that affects millions of people worldwide. It is characterized by the body's inability to produce or use insulin effectively, which leads to high blood sugar levels. Blood sugar is poison for our organs. When it is high, it attacks and destroys the heart structures. It destroys our veins and arteries and attacks our brain, causes strokes, destroys our kidneys to give us kidney disease, damages the nerves in our body. Causing diabetic neuropathy, it damages our retina, leaving us blind, and it makes us stop feeling our limbs, causing them to get infected when they get hurt. This means we have to amputate them. While many of the symptoms of diabetes occur during the day, some of the most revealing can occur during the night. Ignoring these nocturnal symptoms, it can have serious consequences for your health. In this video, I'm going to talk about seven nighttime signs of diabetes that you shouldn't overlook. All the information I give in this short documentary is based on recognized scientific studies so you can make informed decisions about your health. First sign, insatiable night thirst. Do you wake up in the night with a dry mouth and an urgent need to drink water? Nighttime polydipsia, as it is known, is a common symptom of diabetes. A study published in the journal Diabetes Care found that people with type 2 diabetes have a higher risk of experiencing nighttime thirst, especially during the early hours of the morning. In type 2 diabetes, when insulin doesn't work properly, Glucose builds up in the blood. Glucose draws water to the urine through a process called osmosis. Water loss through urine leads to dehydration, which triggers the thirst mechanism to replace lost fluids. Second signal, urinating frequently at night. Do you get up several times at night to use the bathroom? Nocturia, as it's known, is another common symptom of diabetes. A study published in the magazine The Journal of Clinical Endocrinology and Metabolism, it was found that people with type 2 diabetes have a higher volume of nighttime urine and a higher frequency of nighttime urination. This happens for the same reason mentioned before. Third sign, tingling and numbness in the hands and feet. Do you feel tingling, numbness, sharp pain in hands and feet at night? This could be a sign of diabetic neuropathy. A common complication of diabetes. A study published in the journal. The New England Journal of Medicine found that diabetic neuropathy affects up to 50% of people with type 2 diabetes. High blood sugar concentrations cause harmful agents to accumulate in the nerves. These generate oxidative stress, inflammation, diabetes, and neuronal dysfunction. That is, it damages the blood vessels that carry oxygen to your nerves. And without receiving oxygen, your nerves die or stop working properly. Diabetic neuropathy causes tingling, numbness, and headache or pain in the hands, feet, and legs. It also causes digestive problems such as constipation, heart problems such as rapid beats or low blood pressure when standing up, urinary problems such as incontinence, difficulty emptying the bladder, and sexual dysfunction in men. Fourth sign, night sweats. Do you wake up in the night with your clothes soaked in sweat? Even in a cool environment, night sweats, especially without apparent cause, can be a symptom of diabetes. A study published in the Mayo Clinic Proceedings Journal found that people with type 2 diabetes, they have a higher risk of experiencing night sweats. However, it should be clarified that this occurs mainly in people who already have diabetes and use insulin. This is mainly due to an excess of insulin, which ends up lowering blood sugar levels more than necessary and causing night sweats. Fifth sign, extreme fatigue. Do you feel exhausted and without energy during the day, even after a full night's sleep? Chronic fatigue is a common symptom of diabetes. A study published in Diabetes Care found that people with type 2 diabetes, they are at a higher risk of experiencing extreme fatigue. This extreme fatigue it occurs due to the dehydration I mentioned earlier. Due to the accumulation of ketone bodies in the blood, as your body does not consume glucose, generating these compounds in excess. Lately, nerve damage causes neuropathy. Sixth signal, 
Difficulty falling asleep. Do you have trouble falling asleep? Or you wake up frequently during the night? This is a common symptom of diabetes. A study published in the Sleep Journal found that people with type 2 diabetes, they are at a higher risk of experiencing insomnia. Seventh sign, unexplained weight loss. Have you noticed weight loss without changing your diet or exercise routine? Unexplained weight loss can be a symptom of diabetes. A study published in Diabetes Care found that people with type 2 diabetes, they have a higher risk of experiencing involuntary weight loss. If you experience any of these nighttime symptoms, it's important that you consult a doctor as soon as possible. Early detection and proper treatment. They can help you control diabetes and prevent serious complications. Type 2 diabetes is the most common form of diabetes, and it is more common in people with advanced age, those who have parents, siblings, uncles with type 2 diabetes, overweight or obese people, and those who do not exercise. It's also more common in African descendants, Hispanics, and Asians. In women with polycystic ovary syndrome and in those with high blood pressure, high cholesterol, and history of gestational diabetes. If you have any of these conditions, you need to take a test known as fasting blood sugar and glycated blood sugar every year. The best way to prevent diabetes and reduce its likelihood of occurrence. You should maintain a healthy weight, carry out at least 150 minutes of vigorous exercise, once a week. The one that makes you sweat walking doesn't count. You have to sweat and feel exhausted every time you exercise. You need to follow a healthy low-carb diet, mainly made up of healthy fats and proteins. Avoid tobacco consumption and get regular medical checkups every year. In addition to the above, you should sleep at least seven or eight hours per night. More than eight hours in the long term is associated with chronic diseases and less than five hours too. The magic number is seven. Starting from today, you have to avoid sugary sodas like Coca-Cola, Pepsi at all costs or any other canned or carton packaged beverage that contains sugar. Don't eat sweets and treats, or at least don't do it more than once a week. Stop buying processed products high in sugar, fat and salt. It's better to cook your own natural food. You should avoid highly processed red meats like sausages and prepackaged ham, as well as fried and fast foods. Adopting a healthy lifestyle with a balanced diet and regular exercise can significantly reduce the risk of developing type 2 diabetes. This is the best strategy to control this chronic disease and improve your quality of life. Do you want a short documentary about the seven symptoms of diabetes that occur during the day? Let me know in the comments section. If we get to 1,000 comments, I get to work. Remember to give a like and share if you learned something new. If you want to learn how to create content like you just saw in this video and live from YouTube, Here's a free class in the description section and the first comment of this video. Remember we also have a channel for kids. There we seek to raise our youth with transformative messages that lead them to be better people and healthier children. We also have Tuvi in different languages, including Spanish, Portuguese, Swedish, and more. Find these channels in the recommended section on my main channel. Next, you'll see two videos that are of interest to you. Sending you a hug. See you next time.